Hello and a warm welcome to this program on artificial intelligence and deep learning. In this video, I am going to give you a quick introduction about artificial intelligence. I am sure you must have heard about this buzzword, but what exactly is artificial intelligence? We will spend a few minutes to just give you a high level overview about it. Now, artificial intelligence by definition as per Wikipedia is the intelligence demonstrated by machines as compared to intelligence, natural intelligence which is demonstrated by human beings. So, that is a Wikipedia definition. Now, artificial intelligence, the word was coined by John McCarthy in a conference in Dartmouth in 1956. So, artificial intelligence is not all that new as you may be thinking, though now it has become like a buzzword. Right? So, it has been there for quite some time. However, while it was coined in 1956, they were not able to make a lot of progress. They did some research for about 2 to 3 years, but they could not make a lot of progress because they did not have the computational power that was required. In the recent times with the advent of cloud computing and with the hardware becoming cheap and fast, all this has got now reinvigorated. So, that is why you hear a lot about artificial intelligence nowadays. You probably are aware of speech recognition systems like Siri or Google uh, where you talk to the system, that is nothing but AI. You also heard about autonomous vehicles or driverless vehicles that is also AI. So, AI is already around us in some form or the other and we will talk about this in more detail how to implement AI, how to probably develop AI applications in the during the course of this program. Uh, now, AI has been today classified into three categories. The artificial narrow intelligence which is where we are today most of the AI systems today fall into this category. Then we have artificial general intelligence and the ultimate is artificial super intelligence or singularity as it is sometimes referred to. Now, artificial narrow intelligence is a system which can perform one specific activity, but it can perform much better than human beings. These are like the game AlphaGo, that is an AI to play the game of Go, you must have heard about. That is an artificial narrow intelligence. So, today most of the systems are in this category. The next category is the artificial general intelligence where a system can perform more than one activities and in some of them they may be better than human beings. And artificial super intelligence is like the holy grail of artificial intelligence where these systems can perform many many activities just like we human beings and they will be performing better than us in almost all those activities. Now, artificial super intelligence has a long way to go. This can probably cannot happen in the next 10, 20, 30 years. So, it is a long way to go. And as some of the people are a little worried about artificial super intelligence. That is where there are some scary stories like AI will come and will capture the whole world and destroy human beings and such scary stories are there. I do not believe in all of that, but you know there is one school of thought around that as well. Now, when you talk about AI, you will also hear these terms like deep learning and machine learning and neural network, right? So, let me quickly tell you what is the, how they are all related. Now, artificial intelligence is the overall concept as you can see in this diagram. In order to develop an AI system, you need what is known as machine learning and you will go into details of this in the subsequent videos and subsequent courses. But it suffices to say for now that machine learning is where you teach a system without really explicitly writing a program. And a subset of machine learning is deep learning. When you are dealing with structured data, we call that machine learning. And when we deal with unstructured data like video, images and text, that is when it becomes deep learning. That is where we use deep learning. So, that is a distinction between machine learning and deep learning. And in order to implement deep learning, you need neural networks. So, I hope you got the relation between these terms. So, you have AI, then ML, subset of that is DL which is deep learning and to use deep learning, we use 
neural network. So that's the connection between them. And our program is structured in a similar way. We have introduction to AI, then we will talk about uh, what is neural network and then how to implement neural network using programs and uh, libraries like TensorFlow. And then we will go into image recognition and speech recognition, which are two of the most common or most popular components of AI today. So that's how the entire program is structured. So I hope you got a quick overview about what artificial intelligence is and how it is related to deep learning and machine learning in this video. Uh, we will go into details of each of this as we move forward. Thank you very much. Hey, thanks for watching. Do like the video and share it and also don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more such videos. And check out the exclusive coupon codes for our YouTube learners in the description below and visit manipalprolearn.com to redeem them.